I'm gonna put the the poison fog whip back on. Yeah, no, he just melts me, bro. So, on a scale of one, do I'm not supposed to be here? I don't think. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Hmm, probably not. At least with the freaking current oh. armor that I have. See how much experience I got from that. So I'm gonna check the. I think it was like 1100. Huh. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. Alright. <clears throat> I could probably beat that boss though if I actually forget pay any attention to class. Freaking knight that's guarding him, man. That's one tough cookie. Feel like I'd be better spent freaking just running away from him. Right, since I don't know what Mystic Transformation does, I'm just gonna put Fireball back on. don't know what things do what. Like, I don't know what elements are strong against what. I'm just gonna skip that guy. He takes way too long to freaking kill. Oh. Oh, you might be able to do it. So you might be the threat. Yeah. I mean, I didn't think the latency was too bad, but I'll, I'll refresh uh, it. It's like five, seven seconds. Well, oh, that's pretty... that can be kind of normal. That's pretty bad.
it's hard for me to use that attack like consistently because if if I miss time the press design I just dash forward and hit the enemy. Like like that's technically my highest DPS action. All right, the boss has a simple pattern. I'll stop trying to freaking super DPS racing. to use the stupid for cutting shockwave attack with the daggers it does it anyway. Okay. Time to just win. Fun is fun, but I'm sick of losing now, so I'm just gonna win, okay? Is that okay with you, dear, if I just win? Yeah. Out of the air, I do the stupid crescent attack. Alright, with how mobile he is, I might actually want to put the freaking toxic sights back on. Because he's not going to stand in the poison cloud. For enough damage, and the whip it, and the whip's base attack is not very high. Supposed to not jump forward. It's a little noxious because the poison cloud lasts for so long and ticks for so much damage, and it's with the whip, it's so easy to like get it to spawn so many poison clouds in one location to tick for a bunch of ten damages over time. But when right. I po but when I poison him, it's only probably gonna tack on like an extra forty damage, four ticks of like nine.
think it's just, yeah. It's easy to fight him, you just win. Yeah. Dream Crystal and Aloofness. Yeah, he's an easy fight, you just win. Attacks cause hydro damage, don't care. And what did I get? Uh, I got something called a Stream Crystal. A key item of some sort? Crystal of Extraordinary Brilliance, treasure to be obtained by those who have completed the Trials of Stream. Okay. I did that. Cool. Out of this jackass. Wins against the boss, dies against some freaking overpowered enemy in your bike. Did I get him? I got him. That's all the experience slash. Alright. Problem is, I think that was just like a mid boss. Oh. Well, maybe not. Frostbite staff. Ooh. Okay, what, what spell is this gonna give me? Hydro Nova. Oh, I like that. Okay, I like I like that spell. How does this spell work? Okay, so it shoots out like five or six times per cast. That's pretty cool. Look, I want to find a bunch of things that let me get freaking huge MP regeneration so I can just freaking spam spells. I want to play a ranged play. Higher health potion. Oh, he's dead. Bad sand. Alright, is this gonna take me to the desert? I think so. God, I love that skill so much. Down here, who knows? We'll find out. Give me my money. Not immensely effective though. But still kinda cool. Damn it. 
think I was in this part of this area before. I guess not. Yeah, I don't know if I was in this part of this area before or not. Like, it both does and does not feel like it. Son of a bitch. Right. What do I get? Mysterious bomb for upgrading equipment. Okay, works for me. Alright, what's up here? More death for this area. Okay, now, now that I'm fighting these enemies again, I definitely want to have the Poison Cloud effect. Oh. Almost level 55 to get some really cool stuff. Chest opened, another thing got. Where's a boss fight in this area? I wanna I wanna fight a boss. Arena. No, just a big human arena. Alright, like, I love all the unique weapons in this game. It's got a whip, a katana, a short sword, a great sword, a scythe, and dual blades, plus a bunch of different kind of magic spells. Yeah, this is, like, it looks really cool. I can do some really cool shit too. I'm gonna say, is it in it like lets you combo it? It looks like so. So I can do shit like this. Throw in a couple of these. Throw in one of those, and then go wee. Oh, the boat. Okay, yeah, this is back, kind of back. Oh, it's the manta ray. You know what? I will talk to you in a bit, manta man. Yeah, you can chain skills together in a fairly cool way. The one thing I don't like is that I can't cast most magic, if any magic, in the air. Mm. Oh, I wasn't expecting him to. Exotic Gita. Hey, finally some new fucking shoes, man. Finally some new damn shoes. And another shameful thing is a lot of the armor does not change the way your character looks. But there is supposedly a like there is some way to change the way your character looks, but I haven't gotten anything. So I assume. This outfit number thing, like this cloak thing here, is yeah. um, one of the like is the equipment slot you would use to alter your character's actual appearance. Hmm. But I haven't found anything that was there yet.
and you can you can dodge to cancel out any attack animation or any animation rather. Two more talent points. Okay. Alright, let's keep climbing up and see what we can get. We're so close to level 55 where we can get a lot more cool stats. Okay, here's a teleporting area. That's good. Also, potentially a little worrying. the desert background. Man, just the sound of all those hit tick marks just is great. Yeah. Boss time? Not quite yet, I guess. Day 12, someone's diary. Power, I need power. Otherwise, I'll suffer the bullying of these so-called powerhouses forever. Day 13, in such a jungle world, I must seek power at all costs. Day 15, my memories are messed up. I must write them down and sort them out. Renee, is that my name? I've retained my magical powers, memory shards. I need to find and absorb more memory shards of mine to be stronger. The Institute experiments on residents. My resident? Well, what? Well... What should be no more than another memory shard? The ode? My dressing is just like them. I see. So that's apparently that's our diary, because we are Renee. Oh. And yeah, our whole thing is get memory shards to try and regain our memory. Yep. Exploration of this game is not bad. It's actually pretty good, but bosses. I want bosses because I want to get some cool stuff. No way that was just for me get money. I guess so. Right. Let's run our talent tree for a moment. I don't have anything I can get that with. I don't have the secret scroll for that. Slicing Whirlwind. What is this? Straight sword? Ooh. Descending Moon. Swing Sword. Full Moon. Wisp of Valor. Sword tag up. Thousand Crosses. Judgment Cut. Blade for a bit. All right. All right. So. Oh, that's cool. Oh. And then my L two attack. Let's find something that needs to die. Oh, 
up and left then, maybe? Like, there's gotta be a boss near this area. I thought I was already up here before. Maybe so, but I did not see him there. What's this say? Day 10. A mysterious masked woman found me. I thought she was here for trouble, but all she did was mumble about weird stuff like God, the essential, and fate. <laughs> if God truly exists, how could they have let me suffer and wander like this? Masked woman seemed disappointed in me, yet somehow changed her mind when seeing the weird shard I have. She told me I can get stronger by absorbing the shard, but I thought she's up to no good. When I stare into the shard, I always feel like it's watching me as well. I just had a feeling that I can find all the answers to my past questions in this shard. Probably can. Alright, so that attack is not hitting close by. Okay, what's over here? Spooky music, that's what. Oh, is this LB? Is this taking me? This is taking me back to Albedo Tower, isn't it? Yes, it is. Mm. This looks pretty, though. Yeah, it's pretty neat, especially when you get closer to the top. There's one who looks like me. Okay, so I already read that. Okay. Back into the desert. Flash the Whispering Horse. Alright, so that's just another way to get close to Albedo Tower. Yeah, I'm fucking lazy. <laughs> I am lazy. 